Scott, a late, late win against Maidenheads. You must be delighted. Yeah, uh, relieved. But yeah, also delighted because I think the boys definitely deserved it today. And I think every single person inside the ground would have seen it. Uh, we should have been out of sight, and that's. I love my hands up, it's down to me. The keeper made one good save, one was across the line, but you don't get given. And I think the post was good as well, so I'm thankful more than anyone that Nicky's come up with that great header at the end and, and it's gone in. But I think overall, no one can dispute that we thoroughly deserved it. You've been in that position, scoring late winners in front of the home fans many times for different clubs throughout the years. I'm sure you're delighted for, for Nicky personally, who's been out of the team recently, but then when called upon, comes and scores the winner. Yeah, absolutely. It's, uh, it's part of us, whether he's alone or signed. He's one of us and he's fitted in, he's fitted in brilliantly. Uh, since he's come in, he's, he doesn't cause problems. He trains hard, he works hard. He's a good lad and, like you say, fair play to him. He's knuckled down and he's got his, got his goal today and obviously the three points for the boys, which is massive. We'll talk about your mixed afternoon this afternoon in, in, in a minute, but did it feel when those chances come and go, in whatever way they come and go, did it start to feel like it wouldn't be your afternoon or did you, such was the performance, did you keep believing? I think the longer it went on, it was more that it was going to happen. The first half, it was just, I, I can't even talk about it to be honest, because I need to watch what I say. Um, but yeah, the second half, you still get chances and chances and chances. And it's, no, it's not a disrespect. The, the, the problem they would have caused us by a long ball straight down to the front and, and their runners off of it, or, or a set piece. Um, so we knew we had to switch on by that, but if we carried on playing the way we did, Got the ball wide, got opportunities. We, we, we got, uh, we will take one. And thankfully, like I said, Nicky, Nicky popped up with the winner at the end, and we move on now with three points under our, under our belt. You say carrying on playing like we did. What, what was it about this afternoon's performance that, that lifted it above maybe a couple of recent other performances? Uh, I think the high energy work rate. I think all over mm -hmm. we were pressing a lot further down. Um, we're getting in their faces. We moved the ball a lot quicker in, in periods, uh, which is better. Sometimes you can't always move the ball 100 miles an hour. You have to control the game. Um, but we, well, we picked, our, picked our moments, moved the ball quickly, um, there you go, and got behind them a lot. Uh, especially, sorry, behind their midfield a lot. And we're on to their back form, got wired, and we had a lot of opportunities to cross. And I'm sure James will come out with this full of stats and numbers and stuff like that. And they're going to be very, very high this week. Um, and I think that was through the hard work and, and the willing to want to win. You. I might I say deserved the goal, definitely. You, you probably should have had one or two. Were you happy with your contribution this afternoon? You, it seemed like a, quite a, a tough physical game for you up against the strong maidenhead defence. Yeah, um, the first one I didn't touch. I was just I was happy and relieved that we, we actually finally broke the deadlock with Bobby. Um, and apparently the linesman says, because I've celebrated he, he thought I touched it, so I told him I didn't touch it, and his words were, I thought you touched it, so don't celebrate. If you didn't touch it, don't celebrate. I'm not allowed to celebrate with my team. So that was the first one that wild me up. And the second one, well, I'm sure there's cameras closest to the time, and you'll be able to see it yourself. I was probably about two foot from the ball, and I could have kicked it again. But I was that adamant that it was in. I knew it was in, and the only person that didn't want to give it was the linesman. So. You get turns like that, and like you say, it's just one of those days for me. I'm gonna go home and have a long last thing about how, why. Um, but I'm sure come Monday morning, I start looking forward to 10 minutes. And then your header at the other end in front of the East Bank hits the base of the post. When you connect with it, do you think it's in? Yeah. Um, you talk always as a kid, let the ball down. I'm that close, I didn't think I could actually hit the post, but if you looked at me warm up, I think four out of me, 10 shots probably hit the post. So it was just going to be one of those days. You look back now, I'm just thankful that Nicky obviously popped up and someone else scored. Um, but yeah, I, I should have been doing a lot better with them chances. I should have been scoring from there. There's no, there's no doubt about it, and I expect myself to score from there. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm happy about. I'm happy about that bit. Um, but it is what it is, and like I say, my overall performance. Yeah, I've run around, I worked hard. Hopefully, I play my part in the win. I think the team are up to third this evening. Some some late goals. Switching the teams around in those playoff places, it's still all up for grabs, and now maybe the shots are in that position. It's ours to lose. Yeah, like I say, there's, there's going to be plenty more twists and turns coming through the next four games. Uh, some of the boys have got, uh, some of the teams have got five games coming in Tuesday. Um, but yeah, there's nothing going to be set in stone. Uh, probably apart from 
the most we'll win in the league. The, the other six playoff places are way up for grabs. And uh, next week's obviously another massive game for us. And if we get a uh, positive result up there, then who knows? And obviously the game's Tuesday, so yeah, there's plenty more twists and turns. And we can put this we, we can put this performance uh, to bed now. But we can take the confidence from the performance today into next week. And obviously go up there. We're gonna have a right go. We look forward to seeing that. We'll see you on Saturday. Thank, Thank you, Scott. You.